Hi, Mom. <laughs> you know, it's funny, actually. I almost just apologize for calling so late. I, I just always assume that you're going to be watching these at the same time of day that I'm recording them. <laughs> So, I've been doing a lot of thinking about Dad recently, and I know it's not something that you really want to talk about, but there's just there's just things that I just feel that that happen that I just don't know about because you're too uncomfortable t to tell me about them. And well, what nags at me, Mom? You know, don't you want me to to know about my own father? I mean, every day it feels like I'm. I remember less and less about him. It's always cold here. It's not Green Bay cold, but... Okay, now I'm doing the avoiding. I'm just gonna shoot straight with you, okay? And you can tell me anything that you wanna tell me about him. I just... I, I, I gotta know. What happened to the guy? The drunk driver. Now, I don't want to know his name or anything like that, but that's just going to make me really crazy. But I just want to know if he was caught and if he had any type of punishment or if he went to jail. I mean, how long did he go to jail? Is he a free man? Just, these things have been really getting at me lately, and I don't know, they just keep creeping in my head. Every, I'm just trying to take a shower or, or I'm trying to fall asleep at night. It just I keep creeping in my head. See, it's, it's not on my mind because of something that happened here. It turns out Dr. Branch has a bit of a drug problem here. And he's sacrificing the, the, the safety of the entire crew all for, for a few minutes of... How could it be worth it? And the whole crew, they just sit around and just and let him continue with his duties and they don't, they don't do anything about it. I mean, he gets detoxed, but, but big freaking deal. Like, it's like nothing at all. It's like no punishment whatsoever. So, that's why I gotta know, Mom. You know, I gotta have some sort of president to cite. You know, I, I just feel that he should be punished. You know, nothing unfair, but at least punished. <laughs> Sorry, I just, I just, I just wish things could be different. You know, you know, you've been so great, Mom, but I, I miss him. You know, I, I still think back of those high school football games, and you know, I'd look up in the stands and I'd, I'd see you there, and I'd. Just imagine him standing there next to you and you know, I just think about all the things that he could have taught me, like like how to fix the uh, the engine in an electric car and then how to recoil it. <laughs> that way you wouldn't be stuck driving that old fuel sea beater, right? <laughs> Alright, well I'm, I'm toast. It's it's been a night. I love you, Mom. Bye.